Hey, what's going on everybody? Your boy DJ Steady Manos. I'm gonna give you guys a real quick tutorial. Uh, so basically, or not a tutorial, just basically a tip. So if you guys, my last previous previous video, I show you guys how to map stems on here. You click on that and you put stems on there. So when you play a song, you have total control of it. You won't have to click on anything. You know, you could control the stems. You know, take the bass off. Put the bass back in there. I said, Hell no, I don't. You could take all that off. She said, Do you really think that way you belong? I said, You know, and I know you're perfect for me. Everything I need, I ain't playing. What I'm saying. So that stems right there. Now, let me show you guys something else. And then I'll show you how this, how, if you guys don't like this, you could go back to a slicer, right? So I'm using Virtual DJ 2021, and I've been having problems with the flickering. So I did a gig this week, uh, and let's click at it, let's exit at a 2021. I did a gig in Hingo 2020 right here. I did a gig this week, and check this out. Let me show you something. So let's put that song again. This is 2020, the virtual DJ. Now you click on Slicer, there's nothing there because I have this on stems. So you say, yo, DJ City Minus, what's up with that? You know? So I'm gonna show you what I did to fix this. I went back over here, go to settings, and I created a second file. And this one doesn't have stems. See the one right here says Beto Stems. Well, you have another one that just says Beto, and that one doesn't have stems. I went back to Slicer. So now you can click over here, and now I've got the Slicer working again. So when I'm using a Virtual DJ 2020, I go to that, to that, that uh, software, and I got Slicer back on here. So you play a song. I never liked Slicer. Yeah, Alright, so there goes that. So, again, let's exit out 2020 software. And let's go back to 2021. And I don't use 2021 because I'm having a flickering issue. And um, I don't want to crash it on me. So again, you can come over here, you have Slicer now. If I want to use stamps when I might get a new computer or I might not who knows but if I do want to use stamps on this again like I said I just come over here in my settings and look for stamps I created another one called stamps and then that's it simple as that you won't have to map anything so now you have stamps again so hopefully this helped you out it helped me out because like I said I didn't want to I'm not using uh, 2021 right now because of my computer issue. So hopefully Virtual DJ will fix it and let everybody else, you know, because I have to get a new computer and I don't want to get a new computer. You know, for, but for now, uh, I'm not going to use the stem settings. I'm just going to go switch it back over to my original one. All right, cool. And I got to slice it back in there or else it just won't even work for nothing. Or if I want to map it to something else, like um, they have different different ones. If you right click on this right here, they have all these that you could put in your pad. I already have saved looped on one of them. I already have, I don't have remix points. I should put remix points in there. And what remix points does, I don't even know what it does. I just know if we have remix points. We have, I already have sampler, save loop, uh, I don't know what manual loop is. Remix points. DMX. Maybe I should look into DMX. Custom freestyle. What else they got? And yeah, they got all these right here. You know, I was thinking about doing those um, um, effect effects bank. Looking into that instead of coming all the all the way up here and pushing these buttons. Cause this is where my effects are at. Um, 
and I mapped up also. I mapped it. I put up to uh, four banks. So he goes one right here. Watch where is it at? If you come over here, he goes one. You switch it over. You see flanger, flanger, big grid, and flipping doubles. I'll press this button, and I go to my other bank. And then I hit shift, and then that button it goes to another bank. But yeah, that's my. Uh, that's where I do my banks through here. Through here. See, it's effects anyway, so. That's what I use for my effects. I put the ones I like up here in one and two. Then if I want to add another uh, three effects, I just hit shift and the effects button again. You know? So, yeah, hopefully this helped you out. Um, I'm your boy DJ City Manos, and I'm out. Peace.